Hello, human. Thank you for being on the channel. My name is Terrence. The little family adopt a charming young mouse named Stuart, but the family cat wants to get rid of him. Mr. and Mrs. Little recognize that their son George is feeling down in the dumps. So, like, you know what? He needs a brother, somebody to talk to, somebody to keep him company. So, we have Mr. and Mrs. Little. They go to an orphanage and they're looking at all these different kids trying to figure out who they're going to take home with them. And then they come across Stuart, who's a fucking mouse. And they start communicating and they see that Stuart is funny, charming, and intelligent, and he could speak English. So they decide to adopt little Stuart. And then, you know, they come home and then uh, little George is just like, where's my brother? Where's my new brother? And then his parents are like, he's right there, son. Meet Stuart. And then George looks so disappointed. He was like, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? This is a goddamn mouse. I asked for a brother and you bring home a mouse. I should slap the shit out of you for this. And then, of course, you know, Stuart was feeling bad, you know, feeling rejected by his brother. Mr. and Mrs. Little, they felt like maybe they made a mistake. But it's interesting that over the course of the film, you know, George really, uh, like, began to embrace uh, Stuart as his brother when he realized, you know, Stuart's pretty fucking cool. It don't matter that he's a mouse. But the cat of the house is just like, nah, fuck that nigga Stuart. He needs to get out of this fucking house. I don't care how y'all do it, but y'all gonna get rid of Stuart. Fuck that. Or I'm gonna do it myself. You know, I'm gonna lead this nigga outside. I'm gonna kill him or something. But me, if Stuart's gonna be in his house, then I can't be in his house. And I want to be in his house, so that means that motherfucker Stuart gotta go. So you have two things. You got number one, the cat is jealous of Stuart because he's getting all the family, all the family's attention. And then number two, you know, that's a cat and Stuart is a mouse. You know how the whole cat and mouse thing go. Um... And there are different things that happen in this film that are kind of fucked up, but then funny at the same time. On a scale from 1 to 10, 1 being horseshit on a hot, smelly-ass day, and 10 being mind-blowingly amazing, I'm going to give this movie a 6.5 out of 10. I think it's a solid movie, a solid family movie. You know, you could sit the family down and put on Stuart Little, and I feel like it's a good enough time. You know, I do feel that this is a family movie. It's very lighthearted. And the movie is about a fucking mouse who gets adopted by humans. I mean, that that's very family friendly and goofy. But for what it is, it actually works uh, better than I thought it would. When you're talking about as a movie, I'm like, oh, this is actually pretty solid. I'll be damned. Thank you for being here, human. You be sure to like this video and share it with the humans you know. And then you punch the shit out of the subscribe button to join the Terrence family. And until next time, Terrence out.